Brushing the dog out first will ensure the best groomed. Holding the skin taut with one hand, begin brushing the dog. Start at the head and work your way back. Depending upon the dog, you may use different Andis grooming tools. If the dog has long hair, start with the Andis slicker brush first, and then follow up with a comb. Ensure you comb all areas of the dog, including in between the toes. On a double-coated dog, use an Andis pen brush or slicker brush to remove debris or tangles. Use an Andis de-shedding tool to remove the undercoat. Switch to a fine tooth de-shedding tool to remove any remaining undercoat. Next, use an Andis nail clipper either large or small, depending upon the size of the dog. Start by pulling the fur back from the nails. Identify how large the quick of the nail is. Place the nail clipper around the nail and cut small amounts at a time until you see a dot start to form. That is the quick, and you will want to stop cutting when that becomes visible. Once all the nails are cut, it's time to grind down the edges for a smooth finish. Check that you're using the proper grinder head. Run the grinder head down over the top of the nail tip and then back up from under the nail. Smooth around the sides of the nail tip as needed. Before grooming the sanitary areas, always clean and sanitize your equipment. Andis Dry Care will blast away any dirt and debris from the clipper blade and hard to reach areas. Andis Cool Care Plus will clean and disinfect the clipper. Being mindful of sensitive areas, use a number 10 or number 15 blade and clip around the rectum, but never over it. For male dogs, clip around the penis at all angles and the area around the base. Lightly skim the areas with the clipper. Never dig into the skin or apply too much pressure. For female dogs, skim over the vulva and under the belly using the same light touch. For paw pad cleanup, start by feeling in between the pads to identify any mats. Run your clipper on the paw pads, lightly skimming over them. Use your clipper to scoop out the areas between the pads, cutting out all the long hairs. Envision an X and scoop out all the hair. On smaller dogs, you can lift up the hind end for better control. Lastly, clip the tips of the hair tufts sticking out. 